Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be shouting out a few other channels that are doing their own fan adaptations of the Star Wars Expanded Universe. These channels are what inspired me to do what I'm doing with my adaptations of the EU and I definitely recommend them. Stay to the end of the video for an update on our Expanded Universe adaptation wreckage, Empire Issue 28, and if you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and leave a like and comment. Here's a list of what I consider to be the best EU adaptation channels in no particular order. Unreal Cinema. Currently they are working on an incredible adaptation of the game Knights of the Old Republic. So far a Malak prequel is available and the trailer for episode 1 is out. They also have several BTS videos of development and it looks like they have a lot of the series at a far along level. Coming soon is episode 1, the Indar Spire based on the first level of the game. Next is Darth Angelus. This channel is doing an adaptation of Heir to the Empire, one of the first and most popular books released in the EU. He is going chapter by chapter and currently has released chapters 1 through 24 of the book with significant development on the rest of the novel. Heir to the Empire is often considered an essential read for the EU and this adaptation certainly does it justice. Next is Wilkins Animation. They are currently doing an adaptation of the Dark Empire comic series. The art style is truly ripped right out of the comic in the art style of Cam Kennedy. Currently, issues 1 and 2 of 6 have been adapted of the first Dark Empire run with issue 3 on the way. Noble Engine They have an animated short which mixes and mashes elements from the X-Wing novels. Not a direct adaptation of the books, but certainly worth a view, though I don't believe they have announced any future content. Jake Wallace VFX they have an adaptation called Nihilus Fall of Cathar, inspired by the short comic Unseen Unheard, published in Tales 24. Matthew Evans, they have released a short called Republic Commando, which is true to the game, even though it's just a small little snippet, it definitely captures the spirit of the game. Next is Project Revan. While this channel isn't likely to release any new EU adaptations, they have produced a full live action feature film adaptation of the novel Revan set in between KOTOR 1 and 2 and after KOTOR 2. While the practical and digital effects aren't ILM quality, the production value is impressive for a self-financed Star Wars movie and is a wonderfully written adaptation of the book and certainly worth your time. Next is Fan Film. They have released a short adaptation of Legacy of the Force Invincible. While it does not adapt the entire book, it is certainly worth your time if you are a fan of the Legacy of the Force series. Those are all of the channels that are doing Expanded Universe adaptations that I know of. If you know of any others, please leave a comment and I'll definitely check them out and shout them out at a later time. Additionally, here are a few channels that do great Star Wars fan films that aren't EU adaptations. Locher Films, Cinematic Captures, Skyforge, Woof Woof Wolf, AFK, Transmute Pictures, and Seven Cubed Films. Those are all the channels that I can recommend if you're interested in fan-made EU or original content. Go give their videos a view, I'm sure you won't regret it. I'll attach a playlist I've collected with lots of fan films, fan edits, and fan recreations. Thank you for sticking around this long. If you want to support the channel, please go add me on Patreon. Our adaptations can't be monetized due to copyright, so your support helps fund the productions and is a direct investment into the creation of new EU adaptations. Now, what you've all been waiting for, here's an update on Star Wars Wreckage. Thanks for watching the video, we post a new video every Saturday at noon, so please come back next week for more updates and info. 